Hello, and welcome to this recording on setting security controls using workgroups, access levels, and org rollups. Workgroups, access levels, and org rollups control who may read and or edit each specific record in the data forms. Before we navigate to the controls tab, it is important to know that each record in the data forms have security settings which are set during the initial creation of the record. The initial security settings are based on the default settings of the user who created the record. If the user that created the record has a default workgroup of group A with access level of 3, all records created by this user will default to those security control settings. Now that we understand how the initial security controls are set, we can navigate to the controls tab. Within the controls tab, we can see the access level. A user may decrease the access level or, if the appropriate rights have been enabled, may be able to elevate the access level for this record. One is the lowest level of data security, and five is the highest. It is important to know that if a user manually changes the record to an access level higher than their own user profile, they will no longer be able to access the record once saved. For the owner workgroup, this field identifies the workgroup who owns the record. By default, only users with access to this workgroup have access to this specific record. If a user has access to more than one workgroup, and if required, they could change the owner workgroup. Similar to what we just discussed about the access level, if the appropriate right has been enabled, you could change the workgroup to one that you do not have access to, leaving you unable to access the record. If you wish to share this record with all other workgroups, you may use the field All Other Workgroups. Here you can choose All Other Workgroups Have Read Rights or All Other Workgroups Have Update Rights. The access level will still define who in each workgroup has access to the record. If a record is set to an access level of 5 and given Read to All Workgroups, only users with an access level of 5 in each workgroup would be able to access the record to read it. If you wish to share this record with only some workgroups, or wish some workgroups have read-only rights while others may have update access, you can use the Add Exceptions link underneath the Owner Workgroup field. Here, on a workgroup-by-workgroup workgroup basis, we could choose to enable the read and update rights as needed. Again, access level data security is still followed. If additional data segregation is required, you may choose to use the org rollups, the org levels 1, 2, 3, and 4. For an org rollup to work, the user must have the same organizational rollup in their user profile. As an example, if a record has an org level 1 of North America, users with profile org rollup of North America will be able to see the record, but users with the org rollup level 1 being Europe would not be able to see this record. If required, all four levels of the org rollup can be utilized for additional data segregation. Another way to look at this is to think of a funnel. The top level of the funnel is the widest point and would represent the most access. The further you move down a funnel, the narrower and more restricted it becomes. Just as with this list, the more levels that are designated represent more restricted access. Someone with all four levels designated has less access than someone with just the top level. Please keep in mind that this is a general rule as access level and workgroup settings also have to be met in order for the record to be accessible.